inspired to do this through um, other organizations um, like the Institute of Interfaith Dialogue and also there's a dinner that happens every year like in November where people get together in a house and of different faiths and they all share their stories. So this is what kind of inspired us to do this. I think we're going to have a very interesting conversation. I just feel like Islam does um, emphasize, you know, society and getting to know each other and working together and building things. I don't like tolerance. I don't think that's a very positive word. I think we should have religious respect. Mm -hmm. And the only way we can respect each other is to get to know each other. I'm a Muslim and you know, I know in the media and everything you see that we're like these people running around with guns and stuff like that, but I mean for me, my religion teaches me to be connected with other people, to be part of a whole society, so strongly stated in, the, in, like, in, in our beliefs, so I feel like, you know, I don't want to be that person who's like, you know, looked as different, even though I'm, I'm different, but like, I don't want to be like excluded from things, I want to integrate myself into society, into people, and getting to know people, and, and I think the more I get to know people and their faiths and stuff, it helps me connect with them, like. Later, I realized that my belief is actually starting to limit my view scope and that I'm not connecting to other people and that I'm thinking, I couldn't help but think, oh my god, you're gonna go to hell, how do I save you? Beauty of the faith, we show the, the, the duty of the faith, you know, which is I don't know if you can get around showing some of that, yeah. but I remember when my children were coming up, you know, they, well, we would be fasting, and they'd get up and say, I'm going to fast until noon, and then they'd get up at night, right? <laughs> so he's going to fast, I said, okay, that's good, baby. So every year, by that noon, I'm going to do 12.30 next week, they fast till 12.30, and they kept going until they finally were able to fast the whole day. I think we sometimes, especially as we get older, we kind of forget where we come from and where we were right. at that age. You know, we, we, we forget that the same God that protected us from our misgivings are the same, the same one that's going to protect them. And, and that's where I think we, we lose out. We don't really, we're not human. We don't understand human nature and development and that type of thing.